Alright, hello and welcome back to Let's Play yet another No Name Aim game. Today's No Name Aim game is, of course, Championship Baseball 2. That's right, we have an upside down loading screen. Does that mean the whole game is backwards? We'll see. So we'll choose our team and get started. Can you hear that? Sounds like a helicopter's taking off. Okay. So, you move around with the D-pad, A hits, B might do something? I'm not really sure. Oh, cool. All you can do is move left and right. Oh, hey, now that was a little unfair. I swear, I would've hit that. Oh man, I just love their wholehearted effort at um trying to make trying to make the um voice announcer sound well. Uh, hey, hey. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know. Some baseball games, it's like the fielding's a little automatic, and some baseball games, it's sort of like this. <laughs> Stray. Oh man, you gotta love the um, early 80s when all voice acting in video games was very incomprehensible. I have to say, I mean, even though this is a very basic sport or baseball title, I mean, it's simple as the way I like it, because may not be so great at baseball and baseball games. But, I mean, it's like the fielding's automatic, the computer doesn't seem too good. Hey, I'll take this. Yeah. I mean, that's the thing about baseball. You have to, like, not only hit it in the right place, but you also have to figure out how to be able to do that, even. No, oh, that's not gonna go. <laughs> yeah. I, I don't want to talk about baseball strategy. I don't know baseball strategy. Oh, come on. It is kind of nice. So, when you're pitching, you get to control the direction of the ball just by moving left and right. And, oh, home run! If I can keep D up, I can win this game. But on pitching, you actually can kind of move the ball, and that's kind of cool. It's very intuitive as far as, like, controlling the ball, the controlling the pitch. It's not terribly realistic, because as far as I check, most pitchers don't have psychotic powers. Psychic powers, not psychotic powers. Also, is it me, or do there seem to be an especially large number of left-handed players in this league? Oh, come on, that was really close. Alright. Uh-oh, uh-oh. This... Uh, you ever heard of the boomerang principle where, like, sometimes if you're winning in a game, then the CPU gets certain bonuses and advantages, and then... so that they can, like, catch up more easily? Well, I feel like it wasn't just a coincidence that the CPU- What? 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 I didn't- I didn't tell them to pitch. Oh, if you press up on the D-pad, you tell them to pitch. Very convenient. Oh, good. I- <laughs> thought I had a guy there that just disappeared, which would have been awkward. But anyway, I, I don't think it was just a coincidence that they got a ground rule double right after I got a home run. Well, that wasn't very forgiving. All you all you need to be down is you just need to be down one score in an inning and then you're out? Far out players? <laughs> what was this, the 70s? I guess the 80s, which... <laughs> I, I don't know which decade far out is from, but... <laughs> I feel like it was old by the 80s. Oh, that's terrible. Wait, what? So we're looking at their um, batting averages, and is it me or do some of them have batting averages like that are at least triple the other guys, which doesn't make any sense at all. How do you have a batting average over 100%? Oh, can you tell them to steal another base? No, 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 I was kidding, I was kidding. Well, you can, and he does it, even if he shouldn't. 
Remember kids, don't be greedy. Oh, come on, I had that. Can you even hit balls like that? Oh, you can! All you have to do is just really want it. And, weirdly enough, as soon as I hit that ball, it's like, that's... That's the best hit I've had in a while. Hey, even that was pretty good. Maybe I've accidentally figured out how to do this. But, I mean, it's nice, it's simple, it's baseball action. This is baseball how it was meant to be played. Well, okay, no. Baseball probably should always be played in person in real life, but this makes a very nice substitute, and I think I'm gonna win this game. Although I wonder if, like, your performance, like, so all the characters have their own little batting averages. I wonder if, as you play the game and, like, change people's batting averages, you change people's batting averages. Oh, tricky son of a gun. Hey, hey! I feel like that ball was gonna hit... Oh, two outs? Come on, Grand Slam. Well, it was, it was like a Grand Slam. Grand Slam to the face. That sucks. Oh. It's, it's an infuriating game, but at least it's an easy to control infuriating game. That was not the place I wanted to throw it to. I don't know. I mean. I <laughs> made a move. Oh. Let's see if I can use the CPU's same tactic against him. Turns out you can't. Oh. No going home. Just like Men in Black, you can never go home. Oh, cause... If my suspicions are correct, as soon as they score a point, then I'm basically out of the game, so... This is actually a high-tension situation. I kind of like it, you can just lead it. I wonder if this game has... Oh, what happens if you hit them? <laughs> hit by a pitch, you lose. Well, you had to find out sooner or later somehow. <laughs> this game has a, quote, mercy rule. <laughs> uh, we, we, I don't know. Something mercy quarters. Quarter of a mercy rule? No. But it's... Hmm. I gotta say, this is like the first baseball game I've played I've actually been able to control, like, everything, and everything's made sense. Could also just be because it's really, really basic, but no, I mean, that's another cool thing about video games back in the day. It's like, because they're basic, you could just jump in, play them without any sort of real training or experience. Champion Baseball 2. Part 2. Oh. Maybe it's the second half of the season, where the, fir other, the first game is the first half. Pair Play. I really wonder what this would be like in multiplayer, just because... I mean, it's like the mechanics are really simple, so you can really just have that kind of one-on-one -on -one grudge match where you just kind of like focus in on the game and nothing else and just juking out the opponent and you just get in the zone. It seems like it'd be a pretty cool game for that. And there's always the premise of uh, stats. Although, I don't know. I, I feel like those aren't batting averages. All in all, nice game. And on that note, this cat's got a scat.